Hi teachers, my name is Katie Roderick. I'm the librarian at Timberline Elementary School and today I am going to be showing you how to use OverDrive and Sora on student iPads through the Classlink app. So they do not need to download any apps from Meraki in order to use this. If they've already downloaded it last year that's fine, they can continue to use that, um, but they do not need to download an app. They can just browse from Classlink, which is great. Um, and this is the only way we're going to have for students to check out library books while we are distance. So we want to make sure we are familiar with this resource, know how to use it, so we can help students use it. Like I said, they don't need to download anything. All they're going to do is go to ClassLink. And once they're here, they're going to be looking for the Learning Commons Resources folder. I always tell them to look for Tim and Moby. Here they are down here. Learning Commons Resources. Now don't click on Tim and Moby. We're looking for Overdrive. O for Overdrive for my students who don't read as well yet. And once they're in Overdrive, they will have the option for a green button to use Sora. That's a little bit more kid friendly. Um, my, I've made my button go away. My button's right here. But they will have this button right here. So they can use Sora, which is a slightly more kid friendly version of the same resource. And yes, we want to use as GCISD. Takes just a minute to load. And Overdrive and Sora has both ebooks and audiobooks. The default is an ebook, so this is an ebook. The ones with the headphones are audiobooks, and they can listen to the audiobooks and read the ebooks on their iPad, guys, for free without downloading anything. This is so awesome. So they can browse if they like. Um, you can see right here we've got our blue bonnets for third and fourth grade. They can click here to see all 23 blue bonnet books. Um, they can also come down here a little ways to see some of our genres. We've got humor, fantasy, historical fiction for my littlest ones, picture books, and we've got lots of books that they can read. Now, teachers, if you're wanting to check out a book to see if it's right for your students, I'm going to ask you to please not hit the borrow button. Uh, instead, what I would like you to do, teachers, is either listen to or read a sample. And this is, for picture books, you'll only get pretty much the cover, but for the other books, this is going to give us an actual sample of what's in the book. Check this out. The Listening Library presents The Bridge Home. So they can listen to that book, or if it's um, an ebook, they can, here it says read sample. They can read this book in ClassLink without downloading anything. Oh, still not there. So see, check it out. And you teachers will be able to read the first chapter or so. To make it go away, close. When our students are ready to read a book, say I have a kindergartner and they want to read Hair Love because this is such a great book, all they're going to do is hit the blue borrow button. And it will automatically open that book for them and they can turn the pages to read this beautiful book. They can turn their iPad sideways to get a more full screen view. And when they are done with the book, all they have to do is click on the book, close it up. If they wanna see all the books they have checked out, if they're reading a chapter book, it's gonna take them a little while. They can click this home button right here to see all the books they have. Please train your kids to return the book when they are done with it. We, that way they can check out more books, but also another student can check out that book. So it is already back in here for a student to read, okay? Um, and I think that pretty much covers it. If you wanna share a specific book with an individual student, I will encourage you to watch the next video. You can skip ahead to minute four. We have this resource on our computers too. It's almost the same, but you'll be able to share specific links with specific students. Um, good luck with distance learning. Please share this resource with our kiddos. I know they're gonna love having some books to read. Bye.